Hello again, it's uh, Joey John Maguire. I'm in the uh, Beehive, which is in Brixton. It's a Weatherspoons pub. Small Weatherspoons pub. Um, could do with being relocated, that it's too small. It's a lovely, friendly pub, but it's just too small. Especially when they have the music days, because there's a music school or a music disco discotheque somewhere near here and they get shocker just in the wrong place I'm afraid makes it hard to manage I should imagine because there's no room for prep or anything anyway I'm about to um, recite my latest poem it's called Hang em High and it's uh, just to suggest whether or not we should bring back the um, death penalty, whether it be the rope uh, or a lethal injection or whatever horrible means of disposing with somebody. Uh, who knows? Yeah. I personally uh, would vote against hanging every time. But I sometimes wonder whether or not to offer, you know, to give the uh, the correct sentences, like uh, if someone murders, to give them life in prison and offer them, I don't know, euthanasia of some description, maybe an injection every five years or something like that. Or uh, I'll give them three buttons to press. And, uh, so it's their decision and there's no executioner. And I say every five years um, because I do believe that someone should uh, have time to think about what they've done. Uh, anyway, hang em high by Joey John McGuire. The atrocities continue to shock. Every stabbing, every murder reignites the mob to cry hang em high. The war of words begins as those liberal-minded lobby for lenience, then join those more inclined to hang in a head-on collision of heated debate. One step away from tragedy, many of us are unaware as to the fragility attached to our own mortalities. It's always someone else or person unknown. The only time it really hits home is when it's on your own doorstep, too close for comfort and far too personal. Where once I winced at the mere thought of the rope, an advocate for abolishment of capital punishment, I have had my moral resolve tested, having been a victim. Years of therapy and total loss, having tweaked my naivety, but deep down, after much soul-searching, I know I have no heart for revenge. Nor do I harbour bitterness, since I found the strength to forgive, though I still favour punishment as the grieving need to see justice. The law needs to show a firm hand when dealing with violence and corruption. It's not just children who need boundaries, adults require them too. Otherwise, our streets will become mean and feral, the quality of our lives intolerable, and life in its living will be less than worthless, if there is such a thing. Joey John McGuire on the uh, hanging and the knife crime, which seems to be uh, getting to uh, pandemic bloody levels. Joey John McGuire in the beehive, and the staff are wonderful. What's your name? Stephanie. Especially Stephanie. <laughs> It'll be on YouTube. <laughs> She's lovely.